Well, I didn't think it was a well-played game on either side, uh, particularly. We started off turning all over the ball a lot, but we ended up the game relatively uh, respectable from the turnover aspect. We can shoot the ball well and like some of the decisions we made. The good games inside, our big guys were dominant, and that's what we wanted. What did you think of the feistiness, the technicals, the ejection, the flavoring? Uh, no, I'm just did not comment on it. You want to get in trouble? Yeah, it's just irritating. So. You have rebounded of 61 to 42. Yeah. Was the size the difference from your angle? Well, we kept going in. We started off without recognition of uh, where they were coming from and you know where we were going to make passes. And I thought we. Uh, had some turnovers in the process of figuring out how to play against them, but then we were okay. Before he got ejected, were you happy with Bynum's aggressiveness and the way he played? Yeah, I, I was. I, I thought, you know, he obviously you know, felt he got fouled two or three times at the other end of the floor when he was going up and, uh, you know, some inconsequential stuff that wasn't called and then a simple thing that was called against him, I suppose, made him irritable. But, yes, unfortunately, he got uh, ejected from the game. How important was it to be physical with that? You know, I, I, I didn't emphasize it. I said be aggressive, but I don't emphasize, you know, quick, be physical particularly. I, I thought they were active, quick, physical team. I thought they played very aggressively and had a, a relatively good first half uh, the next for not shooting the ball well. There's been a lot of emphasis on improving the defense for you guys. You held the uh, team average 108 points per game to 36% shooting, all the 87 total points. Were they missed shots, or did you see things that you've been looking to see the last couple of weeks? Uh, I thought we had a relatively good plan. Uh, we executed okay, not great, but okay. Um, first unit was pretty good at it. Second unit had a little struggle with it. But uh, the adjustments that we have to make from game to game, I think we're coming together a little bit more on our defensive ideas. So uh, Amari, I think at one point, was 2 for 14. Mm -hmm. So that was... Okay, defense on him, or was he just no, missing shots? We, we played, we played the defense we wanted to play. I mean, I think he missed shots. I've been games I've been watching. He's a, you know stand up shooter. He can you know shoot him with guys hanging on him, and uh, you know doesn't matter if you crowd him or you know stay off him. He's been hitting the, sh hitting the shots. What's the learning curve you need to do in the second unit, getting used to working without Matt? Uh, I think they'll be all right. It's just. Uh, who they're playing with, and um, you know the adjustments they have to make inside of that. I, I thought they were, you know, they're outscored, uh, you know, like 15 to nine in that second period when they were out there. But um, they let it get away a little bit from them. But you know, I, I think they're they'll be all right. Is the defense you play tonight? I mean, is, is, is it good enough if you played it consistently to win a championship? Yeah, I, I think we can definitely win a championship with this type of defense. But you know, the the idea that you know we're facing a team that's a high scoring team that has Smalls on the floor, their biggest guy Stoudemire at six ten, and uh, you know the rest of them, uh, you know most of them are under six eight you know, from there on out, is a challenge for our big guys to stay in the game and guard them. And you know they're athletic and for us to handle the ball so they don't get run outs to take care of the three-point line so they don't shoot the three-pointers. Uh, that that was really the purpose that we had defensively, and we got some of that accomplished, I thought. Um, there's still a little ways to go to before I think we perfect that, if, you, if there is a such thing as perfecting the defense. So these guys, these guys are such an anomaly, aren't they? Kind of like in their own, them, Phoenix, and then everybody else plays. Well, Orlando has a style that's similar to theirs. Um, and it's some of the things that, you know, you see against Miami, you know, a lot of that, um, you know, screens, guys slipping screens, stepping up to set screens with bigs that can shoot the ball. And I mean, that's, it's pretty much one of the factors that is generated through the league. And I think it's, uh, you know, um, the idea to come as far as this league goes. Earlier in the season, Shannon Brown had three at the end of the third quarter against the Clippers. He said it gave a boost in the arm tonight. They cut the lead yeah. from 16 down to 8. It was a similar situation. Yeah, it was a big shot. It was a, a shot that was important to make. Kind of took their momentum and held it at bay. And, you know, got off to a pretty good start in the third or fourth quarter. You getting the feeling that all the Powell might be turning the corner? Who is? Powell might be turning the corner a little bit. Um, 
I think so. Uh, you know, just being alert and, you know, um, thinking ahead. You know, really process, I think, that you know, he's got to go through that, you know, I think he got a little bit numb playing a lot of minutes, and now, you know, these short minutes, I think it's really helping him uh, be more energetic out there on the floor. I feel special energy in the house with the Bradley and the Knicks, your former squad, and higher energy to the game. Do you think so? I felt that. Okay. <laughs> what about the tempo, obviously, uh, you know, much faster pace than like New Orleans on yeah, Friday. Yeah. Uh, what do you think about Lamar coming in and kind of adjusting to that and picking the rest of the team up? Well, Lamar's rebounding was outstanding, and, and uh, you, you know, he was he was effective tonight out there on the floor. And, you know, that's the bench. Uh, he and Shannon having those points off the bench important for us. All right, thank you. All right, thanks.